This is Elimu TV, your channel where you watch and learn. Welcome to our history class. And we are finalizing the topic, transport. Now, all along, we have looked at the modes of transport, the forms of transport, advantages and disadvantages of the various forms of transport. And now today, we'll get to impact of the modern means of transport. How has modern transport impacted the people? And as always, it is your tutor, Rojab. Now, by the end of the class, we expect that we'll be able to discuss the social, economic, and the political effects of modern means of transport. Now, getting to impacts of modern transport, transport system has affected the human society both positively and negatively. And now in this case here, it, affect, it has affected the people socially, it has affected the people politically, and also it has affected people economically. Now, those are the three parts that the modern means of transport have affected. Now, we'll get to start with how has the modern means of transport affected the people socially. And in this case here, socially, we get to look at demographically on the population. That's what it means. One, there is rural urban migration. Now, remember, it has led to development of towns. Now, this has also led to the rural urban migration. People are migrating from the rural areas to the urban centers. And, mo and most probably, they are going to seek for work. And also, it has, facilitated the facil it has facilitated the movement of goods and people, which has now been made faster. Now, people are able to, tra to, to, to move from point A to point B, right, with their goods and services. And this has also been fastened by the modern means of transport. For example, I can be living in Nairobi and still be working in Mombasa. Now, we remember, we have got the standard gauge railway that takes five hours from Nairobi to Mombasa. And also, it has enhanced globalization as different parts of the world have become easier to travel. Now, the world has been, uh, has been perceived as a, as a village. In this case here, and uh, uh, now you can, you, you can get to figure what a village is. It's a, small, it's, a small, it's a small place, right, where you can easily access. Now, through the modern means of transport, the world has been perceived as a village. In this case here, I can travel to all the continents, right, in the world, right, within the shortest time possible. For example, I can have an urgent meeting in South Africa. You can pick your private jet, and in the next, like, five hours, you'll be in South Africa. Now it has led to globalization. And also, social developments such as schools and hospitals have been influenced by good transport network. When you've got a good transport network, we get good hospitals. When, when we've got a good transport network, we get good uh, schools. When we've got a good transport network, we, good, we get good market places, right? Now, those are some of the social impacts, or rather the social developments. And also, transport has promoted humanitarian assistance. And I give you an example of, uh, of floods, when we've got floods, right? Now, the rescue team is able to get to the affected area within the shortest time possible. Now, can you get to look at how has the modern means of transport affected the people economically, right? So the economic effects of modern means of transport. One, we have the local and international trade has improved. And I give an example of perishable goods. We are able to export our flowers from Naivasha to Europe, from Naivasha to America, from Naivasha to Britain, within the shortest time possible before our flowers go bad. Now it has promoted local and international trade. And also farmers have been, have been able to increase food production since there is acquisition of farm inputs and transportation of the produce more easily. Now for example, if I need some, uh, some fertilizer from, 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 uh, from the market, right? Now you can easily access your farm using tractors, right? You can easily access 
your farm produce to the market, right, within the shortest time possible. So transport has also increased food production. And also, it has enhanced exploitation of natural resources. And finally, tourism has developed to a good transport network. Now, through transport, tri the, the tourism industry has been promoted, right, through the airspace, through the water transport, through the, the road transport, our tourism industry have, has, has developed. Now, can you get to look at some of uh, these activity here? Get to explain the four social and economic impacts of modern means of transport. And in this case here, yeah, remember the, the, the effects we just gave, they were positive effect. Now, in your assignment, I want you to only state or rather explain the negative social and economic impacts of modern transport. If you have challenges for your, for, for, your, for your assignment, kindly get to refer to Evolving World History Form 2. And as always, this is your favorite learning channel. Always tune in for more videos, for more learning sessions, right? You can reach us through our Facebook page, Elimu TV, and our Twitter handle, at Elimu underscore Kenya. Thank you, and see you in the next class. Thank <laughs> you.